Hello friends, Standard 12 Chemistry Unit 10 Hello Alkens and Hello Arins Part 10 Last time we discussed about enantiomer, racemic mixture and miso compound and last the example we discussed for tartaric acid it's IUPAC nomenclature 23 dihydroxy butane dioxide acid for tartaric acid you, you can write this type structure also how can you identify either it is dextro or levo only checks the last hydroxyl group if it's on the right side it is said to be as dextro rotatory if it is left hand side it is said to be as levo rotatory okay so it is said to be as meso compound also so for this compound with two or more asymmetric carbon atom here mes uh, for tartaric acid two asymmetric carbon atom but also having but also having plane of symmetry here upper part of the molecule and lower part of the molecule is equal so it is said to be as plane of symmetry and mirror plane or in other word we can say here mirror plane because it's superimposed to this upper part is lower part so it is said to be as meso compound okay so compound with two or more asymmetric or chiral carbon atom but having plane of symmetry is called meso compound let's see another example for meso compound 2 3 dihydroxy butane 2,3-dihydroxy butane CA3 on second position OH group so this this same here you see it to be as 2 chiral carbon atom and its structure we can right here okay this is the plane of symmetry because upper part when it divides it into two part the upper part of the molecule is same as lower part of the molecule and its mirror image suppose it its mirror image said to be as this only the right hand side and left hand side of the atoms are changed you see this is the also plane of symmetry now on left hand side uh, sorry right hand side of the hydroxyl group so it is said to be as dextro and it is said to be as levo because of this OH group okay now Let's see another example. Three bromo, two butanol. This is the structure of three bromo, two butanol. That means we have four 
carbon on second position or that means on second position OH group is added and on third position bromine group okay this, this is the structure of 3 bromo 2 butanol now let's see here the simplification suppose it's a first carbon then it is said to be as OH and H then second carbon on bromine and here hydrogen and CA3 okay this is just structure A now it's mirror image upper part remains same then OH and H then this for hydrogen bromine and CA3 this is the structure B now have a look at this suppose it's here upper part of the molecule and remains steady suppose upper part of the molecule is remain steady and rotates lower part here CA3 CH OH okay now it's rotate to the lower part that means here H and B so compound remains same but the arrangement of the atoms or groups are different okay now for this structure upper part remains same suppose or if we can take the mirror image of this means here C3 and this is to be H OH okay and then bromine and H and C3 this is the structure D so here A is the mirror image of B point number one suppose here A is mirror image of structure B and C is the mirror image of D thus we have four isomers we have four isomers why four four isomers because it has two chiral carbon atom and because of two chiral carbon atom it has four isomers are formed number one two three and four okay so it is said to be as this is enantiomer it is said to be as enantiomer two enantiomer pair of two enantiomer two pairs of enantiomer thus four isomers are two pair of two pair of enantiomer why it is said to be as enantiomer because it is not superimposed to its mirror image here suppose b is not superimposed to a and a is not superimposed to b okay so that's why it is said to be as enantiomer same for here d 
NC structure. Here, suppose you can place this this structure on C structure. So it is not superimposed. So it is said to be as an anseumer also. Now, now compare the structure of A and C. Compare the structure of A and C. They are, they are, here, see this. They are not superimposed. Suppose, see here, see this. Suppose, C. Now, place structure A on C or C on A. Upper part is same, but lower part is not superimposed okay so here it is not neither superimposed nor mirror image here it's not mirror image because upper part of the structure a and upper part of the structure a and c is same while lower part of the c and a is differ each other and they are not superimposable so it is called said to be as dia stereomers it is said to be as dia stereomers so compare a and c they are neither superimposable nor mirror image and they are called stereo sorry they are called dia stereo mers another word diastereomers diastereomers that means here they are not superimposable super imposable on its mirror image nor mirror image okay, students this very hard concept so repeat it again diastereomers now let's see the structure b and c here now let's see structure b and C. Here, here, structure B and C are same. Same? No. Here, the lower part are same, but upper part is differ. Here, this hydroxyl group in C on right hand side, but here for B, st B structure on left hand side. So, this is also called diastereomers also. Okay. Now, let's see here. Suppose, structure B and C. Uh, sorry, B and D. Here also, the upper part are same. But, lower part is differ. So, it is said to be also as diastereomers. Okay. So, diastereomers, that means the stereomers that are not, not mirror image. Are here, not. Okay. Not mirror image. Not superimposable. It is said to be as 
डायस्टेरियोमर्स ओके फ्रेंड्स नाउ लेट सी हियर इन टार्टरिक एसिड सेम टू थ्री डाइहाइड्रोक्सी ब्यूटेन डायोइक एसिड इट्स आई पी एस सी नोमिक्लेचर सी डबल एच देन सी एन सी डबल एच एच एंड एच ओ एच ओ एच सो इट हेज टू कैरल कार्बन एटम दिज फर्स्ट स्ट्रक्चर नाउ इट्स मेरर इमेज मेरर इमेज सी डबल एच only the direction of left hand and right side is changed this is the structure is two now it is said to be as an enantiomer also okay now steady the upper part of the molecule and rotate and rotate the lower part of the structure here from a uh, structure a say double o h upper part remains same okay h and h and here now rotate the lower part so it is said to be s o h and h now it's mirror image this is structure 3 now it's mirror image c double h here only the position is changed o h and h and c double o h okay friends now compare all the structures and you can easily distinguish which is diastereomers and which is enantiomers okay friends and last one the basic about meso compound then after enantiomers then after let's see here diastereomers and racemic mixture meso compound half of the here half of the molecule is mirror image means upper part of the molecule molecule is same and lower part of the molecule is same so it is said to be as meso compound half of the molecule is mirror image okay and second thing is that it is optically inactive while enantiomer enantiomer that means it's a mirror image so see here it's a mirror image so it's a mirror image and also another 
नॉन सुपर इम्पोजिबल नॉन सुपर इम्पोजिबल वाइल डाय स्टीरियोमर्स डाय स्टीरियोमर्स आर नॉन मिरर इमेज एंड नॉन सुपर इम्पोज नॉन मिरर इमेज एंड नॉन सुपर इम्पोज एन एंसर आर ऑप्टिकली एक्टिव ओके एंड रेसेमिक मिक्सचर दैट मीन्स डी प्लस एल डेक्सो रोटेटरी एंड लेवरेटेड रोटेटरी मिक्सचर एंड इट इज सेड टू बी एज ऑप्टिकली इन एक्टिव ओके सो दिस इज द बेसिक फंडामेंटल ऑफ मेसो एनांसियोमर डायस्टेरियोमर्स एंड रेसिमिक मिक्सचर ओके फ्रेंड्स सो प्लीज रिपीटेड twice or thrice times of the video and learn the basic concepts only okay next time we will discuss another topic thank you very much